أعزائي المشاهدين كما عودناكم في برنامجكم الأسبوعي برنامج إماراتي أن نستضيف لكم خيرة من دولة الإمارات العربية المتحدة ولهذا الأسبوع نستضيف المدير التنفيذي والمؤسس لشركة بريكس وود ريال ستيت في إمارة دبي Good afternoon Mr. Ankar Good afternoon sir At the first we would like to know more about you My name is Ankur Agrawal. I came from uh, New Delhi. Uh, so my background is I am a professional chartered accountant and uh, I qualified in 2011. So I am the member of Institute of Chartered Accountants of India. Mm -hmm. So I came uh, to Dubai in uh, late 2018 and uh, initially my idea was to do the chartered accountancy practice only. So my background is uh, taxation and litigation. That was my uh, experience uh, since 2011. So ideally, I came here just to, you know, get the opportunity to do it globally. And I chose Dubai because it's a global platform. You will get like clients of from 200 countries here. And since it was close to my place, New Delhi, three hours flight. So ideally, it was the good place for me, and uh, I chose uh, to be here. In 2018, I decided that uh, yes, I will move to Dubai. In 2019, I, I was looking for my place in the country. Finally, in 2020, I got my place. So this you is started. yeah, I started. 2020, we came to United Arab Emirates. We have uh, our own search data to start a business in United Arab Emirates, but there is some difficulty. Will be to start a company, to hiring new employees to uh, location all these things how you take care that of was it. that is that is actually a very interesting question so I, 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 I'll tell you as I told you my initial uh, plan was to do the taxation practice only but somehow I got uh, I, I, I did not find my place there and I struggled a lot but uh, uh, then I bought a house here and during that process I came to know about the UAE real estate market and I searched a lot so uh, during that search, I understood the mechanism and the opportunities in the real estate market. So I completely shifted my focus from taxation to real estate, although it was very tough for me, but I got help from some nice people here mm -hmm. uh, and uh, they helped me to understand the market. And in 2020, I decided that yes, I am going to be participate in the real estate market in the US. So initially I started with brokerage practice only. So uh, I started with someone in partnership, but later on I decided that it's better to do it alone. So after seven or eight months, uh, I decided that yes, I'm gonna do it uh, alone. And in 2021, when I started my this company, Bricks and Woods, Real Estate Brokerage LLC, I got my license in April 2021. And uh, you will be amazed to understand that I got uh, uh, um, 15 CVs oh. in first month mm -hmm. and I gave interview to those 15 CVs personally so, exactly so the initial agents was taking my interview rather than giving interview so they were understanding that yes will this man be capable of giving my salary or not so that was the time so now alhamdulillah we are uh, One having a team yeah we are <laughs> I will not say because there is sky is the limit and particularly in this country there is no one on the top. Everybody is on the top. The program always choose the top companies uh, <laughs> to be uh, in our uh, program Thank you. and Thank today you so that's why we are here to know more Thank about you so the much. story. Thank you so much. Mr. Agrawal, if we talk about uh, 2020, let us to stay in that year okay. when COVID-19 hit to our doors. Right. Uh, it was not gambling for you to start a business at, the, at that time in a different country, uh, you know, it, was many people they were talking like pump grumbling and all that things sir you mention a word gamble here gamble has always a two aspects 
first, always there is a win side and there is a low side. Whomsoever are playing gamble, they always think that they're gonna win. Right. So I was always on the winning side. So I did my research and I was pretty much sure that if I will be able to establish myself in this year, mm -hmm. I'm gonna be successful here because there is there was a, a vacuum during those two years and people was dying to float their money into, in, into the market because if you will. Uh, it's, it's it's just like if I'll if, if I'll hold my breath for two ma two minutes let's say after two minutes I will rather say that I'm gonna breathe like this so there will be more oxygen into me right so this is the nature of money itself so COVID-19 actually creates a platform for the money to flow naturally so the money which was uh, stopped somewhere, it eventually came into the market right. and the market goes boom, up. So right. actually that was not a struggle for me, that was a uh, boon for me. So that was a blessing in disguise for me. Mm -hmm. So I did my research and I was pretty much confident that yes, that, that's why. I told you my background is all taxation lit litigation, so this is, this is my uh, habit to mm -hmm. study a lot and prepare a lot of uh, research document. So I did that. And I was confident. Today, if I ask you about the strategy of uh, to hiring a people, to hiring employees, what a strategy you built to okay. select the right team uh, in the right place, we can say. Strategy is very simple, sir. Strategy sure. is to hire always expensive people. My strategy is very simple. If somebody is offering you 50,000, I will rather wish to offer you 65,000. Because my strategy is to make people comfortable. If they will be comfortable, they will think like entrepreneurs. Right. So I don't want employees, I want entrepreneurs. I want people to understand business and act like businessmen. So you don't need to tell them that you have to stay after 8 p.m. If they wish, they can. And they will be willing to do that because if they want to make more money, they will do it from themselves. So you just have to make them comfortable. So my, my strategy is absolutely clear and simple. I want best people from the market. Even if they want more money, I'm willing to give them more money. That I want best people in my company always. Let us to know about the company, how you select the name, and also how you publish yourself with the big, uh, more than 10,000 broker in Dubai, more than 18 agency. How you build that? Okay, so uh, this company name has been given by my wife, Shilpa Agarwal. So uh, she is a lyricist. She has a music company as well. So oh, sure. she's always in her dreams. So she's the one who gave me this name. And uh, uh, it came from the core of the real estate, basic of the real estate. When uh, there was no technology, it was wood and there was stone. So initially it was stone and woods, but then there was, we decided that, okay, let's make it little modern. So we decided to do it bricks and woods. Let us know uh, more about the services uh, in Bricks, uh, what you are providing to customer, and also there is a different line, we can say management, holiday homes, we want to know more about it. Okay, please. so we have created B&W as the umbrella. Mm -hmm. So in this umbrella, there are multiple uh, wings, multiple businesses which we, we are doing right now. Is One of the businesses brokerage, I told you, okay, brokerage or one, consulting or advisory. I will not say it as a main one, but it was the initial one. So from brokerage, we evolved into the development. So we created an arm BNW developments. So how we are managing this BNW development is uh, we are structuring with the people who are coming up to invest in UAE and we are showing them the way 
to to the development so mm -hmm. i created a internal pmc project management company so which is giving you a platform to do the development let's say you have 100 million you want to do development one of, first option is you will go to heart of europe and buy a villa 100 million other option is you will buy a go and buy a land in jvc and you will make a building so right. what do you prefer if you, you don't, building, of, course. of course, but if you don't have the mechanism, how you will do it? So I am giving you that platform, structuring, tools, everything I'm giving you. And in the uh, barter system, I'm taking the sweat equity from you. Mm -hmm. So eventually I become the partner of your project. Fine. So I'm investing in my development structure and I'm taking the sweat equity. So bricks and woods development believe in valuation business, not in recurring income business. Mm -hmm. I don't believe in monthly income. I believe in valuation. So I want my company to be valued a billion dollar in next two years, in next one year. Sure, this is my this is my dream. So this is how I used to do. And by accumulating that sweat equity, BNW Developments is doing their own development. Mm -hmm. Our strategy is to create a billion dirham inventory every year, every month, sorry, any uh, approximate 10 to 12 billion dirham inventory every year, either by ourselves or through the group. Masha. Whomsoever wants to invest into it. So this is our idea. So this is the this is this is this you can call it as our main business. Mm -hmm. Our third business is BNW Vacation Home. So it is again just a baby right now. So definitely we are growing it big, and we are investing in technology. We don't want to do it as a traditional practice. So we are uh, creating our own uh, IT infrastructure to make it uh, you know more. Uh, uh, system driven uh, this is our and the, our last business is a music channel which is being owned by my wife it's called BNW entertainments so in short whatever you are making out of these three businesses she is burning in that business right <laughs> that's good to make her more busy on this way yeah so we are a you know happy couple like that. <laughs> mr. Ankar I'm sure today uh, you know some people uh, or uh, you have some people there was backbone uh, your backbone they support you always can we know these people and what you will say to them in front of our camera sir if you will ask me Who's this program here? this program will be for next one hour but i just want to summarize it uh, first of all i want to give a big 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 heartfelt thanks to my partner uh, mr especially mr vivek Obroy. Uh, he is a Bollywood star, mega star. Everybody knows him. Of course. So he is the one who is supporting me, guiding me, and all the uh, connections he is providing to me. And mm -hmm. uh, of course, he is like something which you, which you can call it as a root of the bricks and woods. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, we have uh, people from outside from various developer house from various uh, like people related uh, in the real estate industry itself who are guiding me time to time i mean, i don't create competitors uh, you know i create friends there is no competition my competition is with me i don't have any competitor so we we are having friends so uh, I'm, I'm i'm taking support help guidance from everyone and uh, nevertheless most important my bricks and woods family everybody is important everybody is right. important even my driver is more important even my housekeeping staff is more important for me the cook who makes who, who makes good food for me is important for me and the trainer who used to train me is more important for me so everybody everybody is important for me if you will take one pillar out i will be finished so everybody is important for me wow What's your next step? What the future plan for your business? Future plan for next uh, uh, three years is uh, to uh, take this company on different valuation. Uh, our, our, our target is two billion dollar. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, you can't predict the future. The only thing which is in your hand is to do the work. So we are just doing our work. And uh, my strategy is always creating short-term goals and a long-term strategies. It is just like a book with 50 chapters. Oh. So if you will r see the book like that, you will never be able to read that book. Right. You ha always have to focus on chapters. Okay, And then you have to take rest. Then you have to read other chapters. This is the way to read the book. 
This is exactly how you used to do your business. Exit is the most important strategy. If you are my investor, my approach is to give you exit. If you will take your money home, I will be the most happiest person. Right. So if you will, if I'll provide you the exit, you will invest it again. So short term exit is very important. And eventually you will create valuation. So this is my style of working. His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid, he mentioned in my vision book, we have always to be on the top. It is not easy to be on the top, but the hard things to continue. Exactly. I have read that What book. you will say? See, I'm uh, uh, no one to uh, say anything, but what I can say is, uh, I have read that book. Still, you can see that. My vision, yeah. Uh, yeah, my vision. It's still here. And uh, whatever uh, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid, Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai and the uh, Honorable Prime Minister of UAE, whatever he has done is something which nobody has even dreamed of in the entire universe. He has created something which is beyond even imagination. You call it as a vision. I call it as something which is beyond vision. He has created something. He has changed the lives of the millions of the people. Not even Emirates, but the people like us, expats like us. If 300 people are dependent on me, if due to the vision of Sheikh Mohammed, we are, it, our life has been changed. We are changing the life of those 300 people and their families as well. So it's a chain reaction. So words are not enough. The only thing I can say is, from my heart, I can say that if I would have words to give him thanks for giving us such a nice platform and vision, uh, I would have wrote a book on that. So this is what I can say. Actually, I'm sure. It is coming from the heart, yeah. actually. Yeah. You can feel it right now. As a successful businessman, uh, uh, we will have also a last advice for the new generation to how to use the technology in the right way. What you will advise them? I can say only one thing. Uh, technology is the future. Everything will be technology driven. So use technology, use it in a best way, but with your common sense. Don't let AI rule your minds. Because our brain, what, what, what our brains can produce, it cannot be compared with any AI. Because if you will mix the intelligence with emotions, that will give you the best results. So this is what I believe in. Today we are living uh, in United Arab Emirates, and United Arab Emirates is one of the best country in the world from the safety and security which help us to invest and to of grow course. and to yes. with our family, with our child. We are 100% sure. If we have travel, uh, our family will be in, in safe hands. Of course, yes, 100%. What you will say from uh, you and your team to the UAE? I can say only one thing. I can only say one thing that I want to live here till the last day of my life. This is, this is, this is what I feel. I have traveled the world, no offenses to any uh, place, but there is no comparison of you, to be honest with you. You will get everything here, everything here. The best platform uh, uh, for safety, security, uh, banking, infrastructure, health, education, and uh, uh, ease of doing business. And uh, some, uh, I, was, I was doing a research and I found that Dubai is the place where you can reach in uh, 8 or 10 hours from anywhere in the world. So again, strategically located. So I don't see, I don't see that uh, you should find a, another place. So it, it, it is the best place and it will always be the best place. And it's not about something which I can recommend. It is being recommended by the millions of people living here. So, of course, it is the best place. There is no doubt about it. Thank you very much and thanks to your team. We wish for you all the best and more success. Thank you so much. Thank you Thank so you much. It was really... Thank you for the program and also uh, 
Personally, I wish for you all the best. Thank you so much. It was really nice talking to you. Thank you so much. في كل إمارة روش تسلك عقب وروش بالروم ودن وجبال حاجة ترد الروح